It's going on everybody. How we doing? Beautiful day in the neighborhood. We're out here on some big, big, big properties. We are doing a cleanup. Uh, Bob Willoughby and I, but uh, this guy showed up. What's that? I, I, I'm here at a decent time. I got Look. my single axle Woo. trailer and my uh, single axle. Uh, what is? Area. Wait a minute. What is that on the front there? That's a. Uh, Cedar, talk talk us through this. Oh, look at that. Tim got all uh, sophisticated here on us. Oh, yeah. I didn't put it on at the beginning of last year. I just wanted to get aerations done. It took me probably half an hour. There weren't any YouTube tutorials on it either. So, uh, uh, Did you do one? I'm thinking I'm going to go through it again since I got it all fixed. So out. what was the cost of that little unit? Seriously? It was a lot. It was, it was two thousand dollars. Two grand. Yeah. It, for that little unit. Now, did they? Now did you this. put this on yourself? Yes, I, I did absolutely. After I find out what the shop rate was, which was between ninety and hundred and ten dollars an hour uh, for late maintenance, I was like, yeah, I'll take care of it. And uh, yeah. But one thing I wanted to say about the price of this. Yep. I ended up getting the machine because of the way. Uh, I think the air rate was doing it. This and this together made that the price of what this would have been before. So gotcha, gotcha. Yeah, it looks like a nice little uh, piece of equipment. Can you flip? And can you flip that around at all? This right here, I just put it down. Yeah. But it keeps it from spreading out this way. So when you get along beds and stuff. Yeah. And it's just this little uh, lever here. Okay. And so I've had that up the last time. Uh, that, I'm going to tell you this. This thing, super strong. Uh, I ended up catching the middle of my finger because I was trying to adjust something. And uh, I, I got some good blisters on it. So be careful working around any machinery. Okay, guys. He's going to let me do a little air rating. And uh, hopefully he'll... Uh record for me so let's go to work Okay, guys, so uh, Tim's going to finish aerating. We're going to finish our cleanup. I like that one. You do? I do like that one. Yep. It's uh, it's kind of interesting. Lot, a the Z-Rate is a lot better than the uh, Toro. Lots better. One of the, is a learning curve. you got to keep the outside edge of the wheel over the other one because the outside of the wheels, uh, the aerators, in, or the spikes, or the tines are in between it. Yeah. So there's a good chance you could leave like a foot swat. I, I did that several times several times so you may have to go fix it up but uh yeah it's a nice aerator dude one thing i want to say is like your customer said this we did this for them before and they were like yeah our, this greened up our lawn we want to have it done in the springtime well too. okay so let's look look across the street if you guys can see it look over there yeah. and look at this and this looked just like that last year. You can definitely see the difference in aeration. We didn't put seed down either. Nope. It's just from the No, aeration. you actually aerated this in the snow. Yeah, that was the first snow of the season. <laughs> so, well, guys, we're going to get some footage of Tim running this thing and uh, get out and make you some money. Gitas. Okay, get out and make the Gitas. Uh, but like we said, make sure you got all your ducks in a row. Always going to tell you that. Let's uh, take you over there and introduce you to Big Bob Willoughby. Let's see where he's at. I'll see you in a minute. So let me show you guys what we did. We've been weeding this 
raking it out. Uh, this is a job that I'm going to have Nick and his crew do for me. This is about 11 yards of mulch and close to 600 feet of edging once we get around to the back. And uh, we got her all cleaned up here, ready to go. I think Jeremy's got it all weeded. Yep. Well, not all of it, but it's looking good. And uh, about all we can get, maybe. I don't know. No, we got to get that stuff cleaned out for sure. And then go around to the back. But uh, what's up, Big Bob? I'm good. You got a poem for us today? Do have a little wrap. A little wrap? It's, it's sort of a spontaneous, like I'm a we're good weeders and you are too because you're the master. But I'm I'm the trainee. Okay. I went to rap master school one oh one. He's like and it's like I don't want to do hold, too much. Hold on, let me get let me get this in there so the people can see the the moves. I don't want to do too much, but I don't want to reveal all of my moves where you R go out and just you know, right, I'm, I'm right. Don't steal off me. It's it's not what mine is yours and yours. Right. Is so go like ahead that. and do your let's go brain it, you know. But <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we're going to get back to work and uh, check in on Tim. There's Tim over there riding the old aerator. And you know, I really didn't have a reason to do this video. I just wanted to show you guys the aerator and uh, show you a little bit about what we do when there's not a whole lot to do because, as you can tell, the grass still is not growing a lot. So we're going to do what we got to do to make a little bit of money and uh hey i'll see you guys in a few we'll show you the after view and check in with tim and big bob and then we'll head out see you in a minute all right guys so we're all done finished up took us about two hours and 15 minutes uh big bob what do you think man was that a pretty easy job wasn't it wasn't bad uh, just cold a little bit yeah we're so just getting started they stopped with the dynamic duo Kalowski and Big Bob. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and Tim is going to be here for a while aerating this big monster. This is a big yard, guys. This is three and a half acres. And uh, this is one of my customers. I got this job for Tim, subbed it out to him. And uh, guess what? I'm making money and I do not have to. Uh, do the work I don't have to pay 300 a month on an aerator but I do have something cool to show you guys here in a couple weeks because there's another way to aerate your lawn and uh, we'll be getting into that but hey uh, thanks for watching just a little crazy video to throw out here today nothing uh, no mind-blowing uh, you know, going out telling you how to make a million bucks like I never do because that's just not who I am. But I will tell you, there's been a lot of guys out there kicking their butts, uh, doing a lot of good things. Ron's Lawns, Crystal Rivers out of Florida, he's been kicking butt. Um, Big Mo's been going like crazy, get, getting a lot of new yards this year. Uh, and, uh, who else, man? I'm trying to think here. Wild Bill, I know he's starting up. Uh, so big shout out to you three guys. And uh, new guy just joined the channel. Yeah, Jeremiah Kincaid, I believe is his name. Joined the channel the other day. Thanks for that, brother. And he's out there getting it done for sure. And uh, whew, I don't know, man. I'm going to get paid, get out of here. I hope you guys have a great day. As always, Dr. Real was in the house. Keep it real, man. Have a great day. Have an awesome week. We're almost there. We're almost mow time. It's, this is the latest 
I've ever started. I've been talking to a few guys around Columbus. This is the latest I've ever started mulching. So it's crazy. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.